Hi guys, so today is Christmas, obviously. Um, today's video will probably go up tomorrow because I normally do like film a day, then upload the next day. So yeah, hope you've all had a very nice Christmas and still having nice holidays. Um, what I've done today, we've opened like presents this morning and had breakfast, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I've just got dressed, literally. Um, yeah, I want to show you guys what I got for Christmas because a lot of you have been asking and I think you guys enjoyed the video last year. Um, and there's a lot of pet related things I thought it'd be interesting, like, because obviously you guys are pet lovers, I hope. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'll probably do like a, a little um, what I got for Christmas in this vlog. So yeah. The first thing, well, it's not in any particular order, it's just how I grab it out the bag, basically. Um, so, I got these pyjamas, the Winnie the Pooh pyjamas, they're so cute. Um, I don't know how well you can see that, but like that's the top, and then the bottoms as well, they're just so adorable, and I don't know, you can't go wrong with new pyjamas. The next thing, which is a pet item, I'm actually glad I didn't get the pets anything for Christmas because I think they're being very lucky today because they've got a lot. Um, so this is like, I'm probably going to give this to the gerbils because they love to chew on things like this, they adore it. Um, so what's it made out of? Um, it's a hide leaf retreat. Doesn't say what it's made of, but it's like a little hide as well. So that they've got like loads of different entrances, they can climb on it, chew it, they're gonna love this, I know. Uh, the next thing, I actually, do you guys remember from the vlog the other day when I went into the body shop? Well, I picked something out because my mum said like, is there anything that I would like? Um, so I chose because she didn't really know what else to get me. So I got this set and it's the tea tree one. So I've never done the whole cleansed and moisturised thing so now I've got a set I can use um, so I'm really looking forward to trying this out next item, this is pretty cool so it's 20 LED alphabet string light it says create your own light message um, 54 pieces so you get different letters and they go onto these LED lights to spell something, I think that's really cool It'll be really good for my videos um, so I'm super excited about these um, Next thing, another pet item. <laughs> Sounded a bit creepy there, didn't I? Um, it's a hide, climb and peek pod. Most of these items are from Pets at Home. Um, so this one, uh, it's just like a little wooden hide with a ladder on it and a food bowl. Um, you know, like something they can run in and out of and hide in and play with. Probably, mm, might give that to Pingu actually because I know he won't destroy it like the gerbils just chew everything to death so probably give that one to Pingu and the next thing I got these cute little Santa socks from my friend and I also got this hand sanitizer from the body shop it's a little sniff mm, that is so good I need to use some more of that and two lip balms Never tried these before actually, but apparently they're really good. I think they're also from the body shop. Then my parents also got me some really comfy, like just sort of lounging about the house where like they're really comfy and I love the pattern as well. So they're just comfy clothes, <laughs> chilling out clothes. <laughs> it's actually quite nice to go back through everything because like you kind of forget, you know, once you've opened all your presents, you kind of you know, forgets it's really nice to go over things again um, this says cool plans 2017 so it's just like a little diary and one of my new year's resolutions is going to actually be to use a diary because I fail every year and I really need to be organized how often do I say that and it's never successful but I'm gonna try I can be organized it's got a little rabbit on it smoky barbecue almonds they're not gonna last long honestly guys love them <laughs> and some pug socks which are really cute I've got, 
I've done quite well for socks this year actually. The next thing I got is, it's by Rosewood and it's a boredom breaker. Uh, I've never seen this before but apparently you can get them from Wilkinson's. I just love all the colours and stuff. Um, so probably, I don't know who I'm going to give this to actually. Then I got this really really nice, um, what would you call it, it's sort of like, sort of like a poncho type thing but it's not. Um, does it say what it is? Why did it say oatmeal? <laughs> right, that's helpful. Um, but I actually chose this the other day when I went out shopping again. We went to Primark um, and I picked this because I really like the pattern. It's like this sort of tribal pattern, black and white. I think that'll look really nice. Well, I've already tried it on, so I know. <laughs> um, then I got these rabbit slippers. You can't go wrong with these. Um, I've been basically dying for some slippers. I also got another jumper, which again I chose out in Primark. Um, it's a black and white jumper. Just something different because I don't normally go for things like that. So I thought it'd be nice to, you know, have something different to wear. I also got these little pet blankets. They're just adorable, aren't they? Um, they say BFF on it. So I'm probably going to use these for the inside guinea pigs. Maybe it's like little food mats um, or just like little, I don't know, little lap pads when I'm like doing health checks and stuff. But they're really, really adorable. Um, so I've got two of them. Then I got some more socks. These have got little rabbits on them, as you can see, and then the last one's like flowers on them. I'm trying to make this quick by the way because I want to vlog the rest of today, but I don't know. We can have a super long vlog today, seeing as it's Christmas. Um, these are very useful. I got some pens. These are like, are they fine liners? Um, Stab Stabilo? I don't know how you pronounce that, but I've been dying for some of these. I love them so much. They're really, really good. Um, so I'm sure this will come in handy. <laughs> and I also got this, which is like, I think I'm going to use it for the rabbits. You put treats in them because the guinea pigs, that they're not going to bother. <laughs> you put like treats in there like seeds or pea flakes or whatever and um, then you put it in and they have to work out that they have to lift that up um, so that's kind of cool and this again is from pets at home it's called the actually play wooden hide and treat game so i can imagine piper's going to be like expert at this and big week's just going to get so frustrated um so yeah it's funny that my sister said that she she is glad she isn't me because I've got so many pet things but I love it. I honestly find it more exciting to get gifts for the pets just because I don't know my life revolves around my animals but I love getting things for the pets. I find it like I don't know I just like it so much. Um, one more thing which I actually cannot really fit into this bag. Wait a sec. Can you see? Ow! I just walked into my bed. So this is a baby gate. I'm not pregnant. <laughs> just to clear that one up. This is for my bedroom because I always worry that Vinny might get to my bedroom and this just ma makes it really safe. So if my door is open, I can get better ventilation and also Vinny cannot get in if he happens to get up the stairs. I was thinking of lining it with CNC grids as well. So my room is piggy proof. <laughs> So yeah, this is going to come in handy, I am sure. Then I also got this. I don't want to turn it the other way around, but you guys probably know what it is. It's like this little hide, this little grass hide for the guinea pigs, and it's got dried carrots on top of it. They're gonna love this. It's probably not gonna last very long, but it's a nice treat for them. I just wanted to say I'm really happy with everything that I've got, and I hope you guys got what you wanted for Christmas as well. So I'm kind of excited to get using these things. I'm probably gonna go and give the pets everything. Um, and just sort of film their reactions to what I got for them. I almost forgot to show you guys what my sister got me. So I'll go back in the bag. Um, so she got me this Eat Smart book by Naomi Smart. This is the YouTuber you probably all know about her already. Um, I think all her recipes are they're definitely plant-based and I think they're all vegan as well. So I'm excited to try these out. They look really good. Um, so yeah, that's really nice. Um, what else? Oh, um, I also got them socks with the 
rabbit song from my sister. Um, and then she got me this from the brand Tropic. She's like a big Tropic lover. Um, she got me this handset, so it's like a hand exfoliator and moisturiser. It's amazing. I've actually tried this before. Um, the reason I didn't get it was because it was quite expensive, but I really appreciated that she got it for me. I also have super dry hands, so they need some TLC. <laughs> the last thing that I got from my parents was this Natural Remedies book. And it's a bit different to what you may first think. Um, I kind of just thought it would be just, you know, treating like general things, but it's actually really interesting. It's all how to make your own natural um, skin products, hair products, um, it's basically everything in here. It even has um, a section on pets, like nutrition. Um, it's really interesting, so I'm probably going to be reading this quite a lot. I generally hate reading books but what's the difference fiction and non-fiction I don't know I like books about real things not about made-up things I just I find it hard to read like I just I, I'm not the sort of person who can just sit down and read a book but if it's about like something like this like real life and you know not like a storybook then I find it interesting so does that make any sense to you guys I don't know So I've got peas, carrots, some sort of pie type thing, nut roast, parsnips, roasties. Looks good, doesn't it? Yes, it looks yum. And then this is some corn type thing, because my dad's vegetarian and corn is mainly vegetarian. They do do some vegan things, but this is vegetarian. <laughs> Look at Vinny under the table. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. For dessert, we've got these mini. Are they called mince pies? Mince pies? Uh, no. <laughs> Chris. What you oh my god. I forgot. Ah. <laughs> they're called Christmas pudding. Everyone knows that. I don't know why I'm telling you. Um, they're from Aldi and they actually turn out to be, to be vegan. I can't talk. Um, this is um, a vanilla made with soy. It's really good. It tastes exactly the same as normal vanilla. So, yes. These are for you, Jasper. Dreamies. <laughs> Is that yummy? You can have one more. <clears throat> He's licking my hand. <laughs> oh, Jasper, you're so cute. Merry Christmas. <laughs>
I just wanted to say that I really hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you all had a nice Christmas so I'm gonna be ending the vlog here because I've got jobs to do right now and I just want to have a chill evening to be honest <laughs> so yeah tomorrow I'll be filming giving the outdoor guinea pigs their little house and also the rabbits their little um, wooden wooden puzzle thing um, so yeah, I will film that tomorrow because I am aware I haven't really included them in today's vlog. But yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!